Throughout the Midwest, Monday morning looked a lot like this. I mean, it's a pain in the butt, but you live with it. Wisconsin residents digging out of their first major snowstorm this year Hopefully. with 10.1 inches, marking record totals for the 1st of February in Milwaukee. Yeah, it's Wisconsin, you got to put up with it. A similar story on the other side of Lake Michigan, with Detroit receiving its biggest snowfall in four decades. Residents there shoveling out of more than 16 inches. And Chicago's North Avenue Beach concealed by blankets of snow. The blizzard dumping more than 18 inches in the area and canceling more than 800 flights before moving on to New England, going as far north as Maine. It's sure key west. With visibility dangerously low, government offices in Portland closed early. Forecasters expect the storm to deepen off the southern New England coast, bringing accumulations of 9 to 16 inches in Boston. The area still recovering from last week's blizzard. Yeah, we thought we were getting it off easy this winter because we haven't had much snow and all of a sudden we got the big blizzard and then this and it sounds like there's some more to come. So once it starts happening like this, yeah, you just settle in and you get ready for it. You get plenty of gas for the snowblower. A sentiment that sits well with Pennsylvania's most famous groundhog, Punxsutawney Phil. You can start the winter. Hashtag six more weeks of winter. Phil saw a shadow Monday morning, which according to German legend means winter will be settling in at least for another six weeks. Padmanandarama, The Associated Press.